only three days into this ambitious fan initiative, with 140 days remaining until Nintendo's E3 2012 presentation, the supporters of Operation Blue Wave have already helped this ambitious movement make its first impact. Before the organized operation to tweet about Reggie fils -Aimé's appearance on Spike TV and their coverage of Consumer Electronics Show, the day before that operation even officially got started, an Operation Blue Wave tweet about Reggie's appearance on Spike TV was had been noticed and retweeted by Spike TV's official Twitter account and was then retweeted by Spike TV to their 49,000 followers on Twitter. The next day, Operation Blue Wave tweets had gone noticed by Jeremy Hoffman, a GTTV employee, and retweeted to his more than 2,000 Twitter followers. And an Operation Blue Wave tweet mentioning Wii U and all that good stuff, all those important hashtags, was also retweeted by Jeff Cleagley himself, the journalist who interviewed Reggie on television. He retweeted an Operation Blue Wave tweet to his more than 50,000 followers. And perhaps most important of all, shortly after, in the moments immediately following the end of Reggie's interview, for approximately five minutes, Wii U was trending on Twitter in North America. And you may think, oh, it was only trending for about five minutes. That's such a disappointment. Or, you know, we should have gotten it trending, you know, the whole time of the interview. But let me put this in perspective. We, you, tweeted for about, uh, trended for about five minutes, and it was at the very bottom of the list of, of, of the, uh, the top North American trending topics on Twitter. And it trended for about five minutes, just five minutes. That means that it was so, the boundary between Wii U trending and not trending was so narrow that with just barely 150 followers of Op Blue Wave tweeting and retweeting their excitement for Reggie and Wii U got made the difference between Wii U trending at the very bottom for just five minutes and not trending at all. And that's just with 100, barely 150 followers on Twitter. As we gain momentum, as we get more fans on Facebook, as more of them migrate onto Twitter, as we get more followers on Twitter, as word gets out from you and just from the general observation of what's going on with Operation by E-Wave, the numbers we could have by E3 will be more than enough to make a significant dent in future tweeting operations. But make no mistake, the Operation Blue Wave is going to be much more than just uh, getting things, tweeting about things on Twitter at a specific time to draw attention to them. Operation Blue Wave is going to go, move in other directions as well to make specific actions to that will be visible to Nintendo. It will get the attention of developers whether they're working with Nintendo in the home console space right now or not. There's no questioning that during that interview, those hosts on on CES on Spike were absolutely watching the flood of Wii U and Reggie and Nintendo interests that had been flooding into them as they watched those those uh, tweets coming into them from Spike at CES and at Spike TV, and that is going to be one of the things that makes a difference when it comes time for them to plan their their video game awards show, whether or not it's worth it to take gamers seriously when it comes to Nintendo and Operation Blue I've sent the message to them that it absolutely will and we reinforce that by forcing the world to we dictated that Wii U is worthy of note and is trending by pushing that topic over the boundary to get it trending on Twitter you may notice something very significant missing from this video which is my face because Operation Blue Wave is not about my face. It's not about me appearing on camera promoting my own YouTube channel. Operation Blue Wave is about you. It's about the genuine, natural, organic,
fan energy from gamers that had already existed before I announced Operation Blue Wave. Between now and the next mission, there's going to be so much to catch up on in terms of all the videos you guys have made about Operation Blue Wave. About all the posts and message boards you guys have made about Operation Blue Wave. During Reggie's appearance on Spike TV, all the, the hashtag top all the hashtags that Operation Blue Wave supporters tweeted under were dominated by Operation Blue Wave. From My Body Is Ready to Reggie to Wii U, those were all dominated by Operation Blue Wave. So when you consider that energy, in addition to the energy out completely divorced of Blue Wave that's going to come later in the year as bigger announcements come from Nintendo about Wii U, you can trust that this is going to be a big deal. So pat yourselves all on the back. This is not about me. Operation Blue Wave is not me. It is all of us. All of us already following, everyone who's going to join us, everyone who's just sort of looking, who may have just sort of noticed at a glance, like, hey, what's going on over there? It's about all of that energy. So thank you for your support. And thank you for using my initiative as a springboard to focus Nintendo fan energy and gamer energy into Nintendo's vision for the 8th generation. I will see you next mission. This is not the end of Operation Blue Wave. Trust me very much. There will be bigger things and different things to come. Keep spreading the word. Keep growing our numbers because just with 100, barely 150 followers on Twitter, we were able to get... Wii U trending as a trending topic in North America right as Reggie fils appeared on Spike TV and as Wii U appeared on TV for the first time since we, since E3. We are only three days in and we've already accomplished the goal of uh, one of our goals and the goals to come will be bigger and as we get more supporters they will be bigger and that's all I have to say for now without uh, rambling more than I already have. So, you know, mark your calendars. 147 days to go, and we're just getting started. So thank you very much for supporting this initiative. And I hope to see you in future missions and on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and other corners of the Internet.